bills collected by bank on behalf of customers it is nothing but some people have to give you money which the bank is collecting on your behalf there is nothing great it is just equal to de uh, direct deposits next one wrong entry on the credit side of passbook that means bank by mistake has entered some amount on the credit side so i can say because it entered on the credit side we are writing the error that is the mistake on the credit side even though it is a mistake it will increase your bank balance temporarily unless and until it is corrected by the bank on a later date so next one coming to the items if you see there are some items that are subtracted so first is checks paid into bank but not yet cleared it is checks paid into bank it is not checks paid checks paid into bank means you have deposited the check what someone gave you into your bank so when you deposit checks into bank if not today tomorrow your bank balance will increase when it is collected by the bank so because you are the initiator of the transaction entry will be first in the cash book we say checks deposited it is also called as checks paid in or sometimes you will find checks sent for collection or in some cases you will find checks lodged with bank all these are one and the same simply you are putting a check what you have in the bank so when you put a check in the bank ultimately according to your bank balance will increase now the next item is interest and expenses charged by the bank so charged by the bank is bank is taking interest from you or asking interest from you and similarly charges that is what we discussed initially as service charges so i will say here interest on loan usually it is interest on loan or od that is overdraft or overdraft similarly service charges service or collection charges service or collection charges next is direct payments by bank what are direct payments by bank for instance you have to pay nowadays you pay your electric bill mobile bill uh, internet bill whatever other payments utility bills via internet or through your mobile so such things are nothing but you are transferring money which is there in your bank to those parties to whom you have to pay so in previous cases or even now you can give instructions to your bank that is let us say your electricity department or your telephone department or your internet provider whenever you have to pay money or that is your bill becomes due you ask them to send the bill to your bank and you also instruct your bank whenever they you they receive your bills to make the payment so these are called direct payments these are called direct payments so because bank will be paying your money your bank balance will come down so which we enter on the debit side of passbook which bank enters on the debit side of the bus passbook dishonor of bill or check dishonor of bill dishonor of bill or dishonor of bills receivable i'll write next bills receivable discounted the word discounted is important just remember this you'll understand in detail what is bill discounted 
in the next second year. Now, checks debited in cash book but forgot to send to bank. Okay, it is nothing but you say checks deposited but you did not send it to bank. Naturally, it is deposited but it is still lying in your pocket. So, that is the cash book entry. Wrong entry on the debit side of passbook. Wrong entry, same error. Similarly, there might be some errors on the debit side of cash book. Similarly, some on cash book credit side. So, because of these reasons, remember your passbook balance will increase when items have to be recorded on the credit side of passbook. Your passbook balance will decrease when items are to be recorded on the debit side of your passbook. So, for this entry, the impact on the cash book will be opposite, we say. Suppose we say passbook balance is increasing for this transaction. For the same transaction, we should assume okay, there is no change in the cash book balance. So, let us say initially both were at 100. Your cash book balance and your passbook balance were 100. Now, because bank gave you interest 200, how much your passbook balance will become? It will increase and become 300. So, we say this passbook balance is increasing, but this is same at 100. So, we can simply say it is decreasing the other way. This is how you analyze the transactions.